Hello and welcome to this new video presented to you by the Gamesmith from our tutorial series on creating your own 2D platformer game with Unity. In this video, we'll learn how to give our players the ability to shoot bullets whenever a certain key in the keyboard is pressed. So let's dive into Unity and do it. So first of all, we'd like to grab our bullet sprite and drag it into the scene and then resize it to fit our required size. I'll just change the color a little bit so that we're able to differentiate it from the coin. So that's fine now. After that we'd like to add a circle collider and then a rigid body 2D. For the rigid body we want to set it as kinematic and if you're not using a circle as your bullet you would like also to freeze the rotation around the z-axis. So now we'd like to add a tag and we'll call this tag bullet. Back again to our bullet sprite and set the tag to bullet. Now drag and drop the bullet from the scene inside our assets folder and delete it from the scene. Okay, now we create a empty game object. I'll just give it an icon so that we're able to see it in the scene. And then move it and position it just outside the player. You don't want it to be directly inside the player because this will stop the bullets from going out. Now make this game object a child of our player and now we can do some coding so we head to our player control script and we'd like to declare some variables first of all a public float and we'll call this one force then another public game object which will be our bullet and finally a public transform which will be sorry public or shot point Now we head straight to our update function and here we want to shoot a bullet only if our player pressed a certain key. So put it into an if statement. So now we'll type if input dot get key down between two brackets we'd like to write key code dot I'll set this to left control key for example but you can put any other key you want and if this condition is met we'd like to call the function called shoot okay so as you see it gave us an error but this is only because we don't have any valid functions called shoot. So let's create one. Outside of our update function we'd like to create a void and we'll call this shoot now inside this function we type game object called shot equal instantiate between two brackets we'd like to write bullet which is the object will be instantiated then shot point dot position 
the place it will be instantiated from and finally shot point dot rotation then we declare a new rigid body 2d and we'll call this rb equal to shot dot get component and rigid body 2d and to adjust the direction of the bullet we type if facing right is equal to false we want to add force to our rb so rb dot add force between two brackets we type shot point dot right multiplied by force and then our force mode 2d set it to impulse and then else if facing right is equal to true we want to add force again so just copy this line of code paste it here but only multiply it by negative one now we save this code and head back to unity So we drag our shot point empty game object to the shot point section and set our force to for example 5 and drag our projectile to its position here. Then when you play the game you'll see that whenever the player presses the left control button the bullet shoots. Thank you for watching. If you learned something new today, please don't forget to like the video and share it between your friends. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to post them in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. See you in the next part.